Hello everyone, this is Harley from Garden FL and today we're going to be reviewing three of my favorite Anonos which are the Cherry Moya, the Sour Shop, and the Sugar Apple. Now I'm going to be reviewing and showing the similarities and differences of these three fruits of the Anona Shea family. Now these fruits sometimes get often confused for one another and so I'm just gonna make this video to kind of help you understand the details and the differences between them because all three of them are very delicious fruits and they often get confused for one another. So I hope you learned something new today and let's get to opening Anona's. So we're gonna start with the sugar apple. The sugar apple is known as Anona squamosa. As you see all around the sugar apple, you will see these bumps that go around it. Now you will know it's a sugar apple because the sugar apples have a very rigid surface and as you see they typically look like this. So you will know the sugar apple is actually ready to eat. When you press on it it will start to give in a little bit and as you see this one is already trying to split so we're just going to open it like this. And the sugar apple inside is characterized by its white creamy flesh and you will notice that the sugar apple is very seedy but still the interior of the fruit is lined very symmetrical on the inside. Up next is a cherimoya. Now this fruit is known as Anona cherimola. Now what makes this fruit different is that it has a smooth surface unlike the sugar apple that was bumpy and on the, you will notice it also has some ridges on the inside. Now some varieties of cherimoya have some spikes still so not all cherimoyas look like this. And just like the sugar apple you can tell when it's ripe when you start to push on it and it will start to give in a little bit. So. I like to cut these like this, middle. So you can tell it's cherimoya on the inside by telling how smooth the inside is. It's not all kind of seedy like the sugar apple was. As you see, the insides of these fruits are, are completely different. One is more uniform and stays together, which is a cherimoya. And then the sugar apple kind of comes apart in segments as you eat it. So next up is a soursop, which is known as Anona muricata. Here in Colombia, we call them guanamana. But as you see, the guanamana usually gets very much larger compared to the cherimoya and then the sugar apple. As you see, it's just Goliath compared to it. As you see, the sour shop is just huge, massive. So we're gonna cut it open and show you the similarities of all of them. So for the sour shop, you'll also know when it's ripe because when you start to press, it will give in a little bit. And you can actually start to peel on the sour shop too to check on the inside when it's ready. So this will indicate that it's really ready when it's really pearly white flesh. You could tell because the flesh inside will be pearly white and very aromatic too. The sour sop. Beautiful. Okay, so continue opening the sour sop. How I like to do it is I just like to cut it straight down the middle. And I'll show you inside. As you see, it's very, very similar to what a sugar apple or cherry moya would look like on the inside. So when you split it open, as you see, you could tell the resemblance between just a regular cherry moya. So as you see, you can see the similarities. This is actually a sugar apple in my hand. But as you can see how the seeds are aligned along and in the center of the fruit. And then the same thing with the cherry moya. This cherry moya I didn't cut as clean, but as you see, they all have their similarities, kind of pointing them to the Anunase family. Oof, yeah, and I really love guanamana. Guanamana is probably one of my favorites. I love sugar apple too, but this fruit is just so healthy for you. I want to show you the seeds. So believe it or not, but the cherimoya actually has the bigger seed out of all three of these fruits. This is a cherimoya seed right here. This is a sugar apple seed, and this is the soursop seed. Now, soursop seeds actually have a, a browner tint to them, uh, while the sugar apple seeds are pretty dark as well as the cherimoya. But the cherimoya seeds are just noticeably larger than both of the other seeds. So thank you guys so much for watching this comparison video of the Anonas, the sugar apple, cherimoya, and soursop. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you love Sugar Apple or just the Nona Shea family like I do, please give me a follow and a thumbs up on this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite Anona is. Uh, you know, I love Alamas too. And you know, so many other Sugar Apples, Custard Apples, oof, so many to name. But thank you guys. I hope you have a great day. Happy holidays and hope you eat some good fruit soon.